So last week, we focused on the little scribble. And the little scribble talked about all the different feelings that you can have, and sometimes you can feel them all at once. Well, this week we're gonna focus on a little spot of happiness. I really enjoy these books, and I hope you are too. Hi, I'm Happiness Spot. I'm here to help you feel joy and spread happiness to others. Did you know one person has the power to grow hundreds of happiness spots, all with one kind act? Let me show you how. What does that mean? With one kind act, you can spread happiness. Hmm. It can start with you being kind and helping Jimmy up when he falls down. Because you were kind, Jimmy wants to be kind too. So he shares his toys with Lucy. Your new glasses look great. I love the color red. Lucy wants to keep spreading happiness. So she says something nice to Tucker. And the pattern of kindness continues. So maybe when you're nice to someone, that someone will be nice to someone else. And then that someone will be nice to someone else and it'll keep on going and going and going. You can use several spots to help a happiness spot grow too. Love, confidence, and peace are some of the happiest spots I know. Think about all the people you love in your life and all the people who love you. Love can grow a happiness spot. I know I can think about my husband, all my wonderful friends, and my sweet baby who I love, and they make me very happy. Create art. Even if you feel you are not good at it, when you create something from the heart, it can be one of the greatest gifts to give. Creating can grow a happiness spot. I made this for you. Maybe you can make a piece of art for your mom or your dad or your grandparents or whoever you're staying with. I am brave, I am loving, I am kind. When you believe in yourself, it is easier to see the good in others. Confidence can grow a happiness spot. Learn how to manage your emotions. When you are calm, it can help you to calm people around you. Being peaceful can grow a happiness spot. Being peaceful and calm is what you call contagious. If I'm very stressed out and maybe I go to see Ms. Froberg and she's very calm, her calmness is gonna rub off on me and then I'm gonna feel calm. Another way to spread happiness is with gratitude. Gratitude is being thankful and showing appreciation with kindness. Try writing three things you are thankful for every day. It's so easy to do and it can start your day in a positive way. One of your activities this week is to do something like that. Write a thank you note too. It lets people know that you are grateful for them. Being thankful can grow a happiness spot. Thank you, Mrs. Curtis, for being an amazing teacher. Maybe you can write to your teacher, letting them know that they're doing a great job. I bet they'd really appreciate it right now. Take time to enjoy all the things around you. Point out all the beautiful things to others too. Appreciation can grow a happiness spot. Smile. Making yourself smile tricks your brain into thinking happy thoughts. Go ahead and try it. Did you know when you smile and it makes other people want to smile too? Smiling can grow a happiness spot. Smiling is contagious too, just like being calm. Create something new and help others to do the same. Imagination can grow a happiness spot. Take care of the planet. You can recycle or plant a tree it doesn't look like much now, but every little action matters. Caring can grow a happiness spot. Find a great book. 
you might learn something new. Use your imagination and experience new places. Reading can grow a happiness spot. Reading this book is making a happiness spot for me. Sometimes you just need a reminder to spread happiness. So wear a spot on your hand and every time you spot me, think of a happy thought and spread happiness. So this week, I want you to work on spreading happiness. Feel happy about yourself. Feel happy about the people around you and maybe help other people to feel happy too. I'm here to help you feel happy. Remember, you can reach out to me whenever you need me. Love you guys and have a great and happy week.